All right, what's up? Lil Lotus um, here at the castle, and we're going to do a tattoo tour. My first tattoo. Damn, I'm going to have to do my toes. If my toes look wild, don't get my toes. I got that one. Damn, I got dirty ass feet. And I got this ankle one right here with my brother. I got this on top of my foot. Damn, my toes look crazy. Y'all can't look. So one, two, three. I had one. In like older pictures, you could see it, and it's, it was a tattoo right here, but it's all blacked out. Now it's covered up. Actually, maybe it was just four. I think it was just the four. Yeah. Now I'm all barefoot. <laughs> Y'all went straight for the feet. Your most painful tattoo. Most pain. Oh, my palms. Like, both my palms. Like that one and that one. Like, I think it's like mostly because I didn't expect it to hurt at all, really. And then it's always the tattoos that you're like, nah, it's going to be chill. And then yeah, I was sweating. I thought, I was like, that's what I would. I've passed kidney stones before, and sweaty. palms are sweaty. <laughs> uh, I've passed kidney stones before, and I thought that was painful, but this is, like, way more painful than kidney stones. Most pain. Oh, my palms. Like, both my palms. Like, that one and that one. Like, I think it's, like, mostly because I didn't expect it to hurt at all, really. And then it's always the tattoos that you're like, ah, it's going to be chill. And then I was sweating. I thought I was like, that's what I would. I've passed kidney stones before and sweaty. palms are sweaty. <laughs> uh, I passed kidney stones before and I thought that was painful. But this is like way more painful than kidney stones. Uh, <laughs> oh, my dick. That was the last one I got. I'm not showing you. Up. <laughs> yeah. I have my son's name on my face. Or is it this side or this one? It says it's like. Oh no, that's the news. Okay. <laughs> yeah, my son's name right here. That one, and I got my mom's name right there. Shout out mom. Shout out Luca. The worst tattoo trend. I don't know if I'm like aware of like uh the tattoo trends right now but i do remember when uh, i remember like old ones that i hated and i remember when um people would do the mustache on the finger yeah and i was like shut the fuck up like i hated that shit it was yeah that that one i hated that one make sure it's something you really want like i feel like if you go you start off with the ones that are like meaningful like you're, it's always going to be meaningful you know like if it's like for your parents or the you know loved ones whatever it's always going to be meaningful so you'll never want to get those covered up so that's not like a bad go-to for your first time but definitely go to somebody where like don't do like the whole like oh i can get this for fifty dollars uh, yeah, go come to the castle and pay big money. <laughs> but like, no, literally, like, go to somebody that you know, like, that you're actually paying for. Like, you, you get what you pay for, type thing. Not like, oh, my home. You just want something on you, and then your homie can hook you up, or his his friend, or whatever, and they just like scratch some shit on you. Cause like, I have a bunch of those, and I'm working on covering them up. <laughs> I've definitely had a bunch of tattoos I regret. Like, even, like, the just, like, the ones I drew on, I was just, like, fucked up or whatever because I was, like, damn, like, I want to use that space. I still can, but it just, like, kind of fucks with the whole thing. So, yeah, I stop. I Yeah, I'm running out of space now, and I also just, like, I just, yeah, I stopped doing that shit because I was, like, I want to be able to let people put cool shit on there without having to worry, worry about covering up little, like, dark lines and shit. Oh, I can show you that one, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, one second. Hey, first, why are you spreading your cheeks? Well, I don't know where it is. <laughs> you gotta spread it. Wait, did you see it though? Yeah, did you okay. see it without spreading it? Yeah. 